Blessed is our God always, now and forever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to you, our God. Glory to you, O heavenly King, comfort of the spirit of truth, who are present in all places and filling all things, the treasury of good things and giver of life. Come and dwell within us. Cleanse us of every stain and save our souls a good one. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but not forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. All Holy Trinity, have mercy on us. Lord, cleanse us from our sins. Match part of our transgressions. Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for your name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but not forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art Lord in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on <coughs> earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son of the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Kirelation, 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 Kirelation. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Kirelation, 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 Kirelation. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, to the ages of ages. Amen. Δεύτε προσκυνήσουμε και προσπέσουμε το Βασιλεί μόν Θεό. Δεύτε προσκυνήσουμε και προσπέσουμε Χριστό το Βασιλεί μόν Θεό. Δεύτε προσκυνήσουμε και προσπέσουμε αυτό Χριστό το Βασιλεί και Θεό ημών. Ακούσε ο κύριο εν ημέρα θλίψεω. Περασπίσε σου το όνομα του Θεού Ιακώβ. Εξ αποστήλε σου βοήθεια εξ Αγίου. Και εξιών αντιλάβει το Σι. Μισθή πάση θυσία σου. Και το ολοκόφταμά σου πιανάτο. Δόη σου κύριο κατά την καρδία σου. Και πάσαν την βουλή σου πληρώσε. Αγαλία σώμεθα εντό σωτηρίου σου. Και εν ονόματι Θεού ημουν, μεγαλήν θυσόμεθα. Πληρώσε Κύριος πάντα τα αιτήματά σου, νυν έγνον ότι έσωσε Κύριος τον Χριστόν αυτού. Ακούσε εσύ αυτού εξ ουρανού Αγίου αυτού, εν δυναστείε εσείς δεξιά, η σωτηρία της δεξιάς αυτού. Ούτε εν όρμαση και ούτε εν ύπης, εμείς δε ονόματι Κυρίου Θεού ημών μεγάλην θυσόμεθα. Αυτοί συνεποδίστησαν και έπεσαν, εμείς δε ανέστημεν και ανορθώθημεν. Κύριε σώσον τον βασιλέα και πάκουσον ημών εν η ανημέρα επικαλεσόμεθα σε. The King shall be glad in your power, and your salvation he will greatly rejoice. You gave him his soul's desire, and you did not deprive him of his lips' request. For you anticipated him with blessings of goodness. You placed a crown of precious stones on his head. He asked you for life, and you gave it to him. Length of days unto ages of ages. Great is his glory in your salvation. Glory and majesty you shall place upon him, for you shall give him blessing unto ages of ages. You shall fill him with the joy of your presence, for the king hopes in the Lord, and in the mercy of the Most High he will not be shaken. May your hand be found on all your enemies, may your right hand find all who hate you. You shall make them like a fiery furnace in the time of your presence. The Lord shall throw them into confusion in his wrath, and the fire shall devour them. You shall destroy their offspring from the earth and their seed from among the sons of men. For they vented all of their evils against you. They reasoned through a council they could not establish. For you shall make them turn their back among your remnants. You shall make ready in their countenance. Be exalted, O Lord, in your power. We will sing in your praise your mighty deeds. I ask the Lord, I see 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 the
Tas vodas horizontas no mesimin aigia biskeps aigia setas sesenia simon engen aneketuona matosu kirelesen 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 dox abate ke yo ke yo pneumatik ne ke aigia sesenia simon amin patri moen moen disranis aigia seto dona masu seto e vasiliasu yani seto totali masu o asino no de kapitis to no atri moen to rivision dosimin simon ke afisimita primata imon Oske mi sa fi meti sa fi lati simon, ke mi si ke negi si mas si spiras mon, ale re si mas putu poniru. Oti si uesti ni vasili e ke vini mi ske dok sa tu patros ke tu iu ke tu aiu knev matos, nin ke ai ke isti se onas to ne onon. Amin, sosun kiri ton la on su ke vlogi son di glironomi an su nikas tis vasilevsi kada varvaron do rumenos ke doson filaton dia tu sta vrusu politevma. Δόξα πατρί και ιό και αγίο πνεύματι, ο ύψωθή εντό σταυρό εκουσίου στη επωνύμου σου καινή πολιτεία, του συκτηρμού σου δόρισε Χριστέ ο Θεό. Έφρανόν εν τη δυνάμει σου του πιστού βασιλεί Σιμών, νίκα χορηγών αυτή κατά των πολεμίων, την συμμαχία να έχει εν την συν όπλων ειρήνη αίτη των τρόπεων. Και νυν και αιν και ει του αιώνα των αιών να μην προστασία φοβερά και ακατέσχυνται, μη παρίδει αγαθήτα σε και εσύ εσυμών. Πανίμνητε Θεοτό και στήριξε τον Ορθοδόξο Πολιτεία. Σω ζεού σε κέλευσα βασιλεύειν. Και χορηγεί αυτού ουρανό θεν την οίκη, διότι έτε και στον Θεόν μόνοι ευλογημένοι. Ελέισον ημά ο Θεό και τον Μεγαλέο είδε με θάσιο πάκουσον και ελέισον. Κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον. Έτι δε με θα υπέρ των Εσεβών και Ορθοδόξων Χριστιανών. Κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον. Έτι δε με θα υπέρ του Αρχιεπισκόπου και Πατρόπου. Κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον. Ότι αλεήμον και φιλάνθρωπο έω υπάρχει, και εσύ την δόξα να πέμπομεν. Το πατρί και το ιό και το αίο πνεύμα την ίν και αή και ει του αιώνα των αιώνων. Αμήν, εν ονομάτι κυρίου ευλόγησον, πάτε. Δόξα τη Αγία και μοσία και ζωπιό και δρέ το τριάδι πάντοτε νυν και αή και ει του αιώνα των αιώνων. Αμήν, δόξα εν υψή τη Θεό και επηγή ειρήνη εν ανθρώπη ευδοκία. Δόξα εν υψή τη Θεό και επηγή ειρήνη εν ανθρώπη ευδοκία. Δόξα εν υψή τη Θεό και επηγή ειρήνη εν ανθρώπη ευδοκία. Κύριε τα χείλη μου ανοίξει και το στόμα μου αναγγελεί την ένεσή σου. Κύριε τα χείλη μου ανοίξει και το στόμα μου αναγγελεί την ένεσή σου. Κύριε τι επρήρθησαν οι θλίβοντέ με, πολλοί επανίστατε επ' με. Πολλοί λέγουσα τη ψυχή μου και στη σωτηρία αυτό εν το Θεό αυτού. Σίδε κύριε εντελήπτορ μου ή δόξα μου και υψών την κεφαλή μου. Φωνή μου προς ε, Κύριο να και άκραξα και επίκουσα με εξόρους Αγίους αυτού. Εγώ δε εκοιμήθην και ύπνοσα, εξηγέρθην ότι Κύριος αντιλήψετε μου. Ου φοβηθήσω με από μυριάδων λαού το κύκλο συνεπίτεθε με να μη ανάστα κύριε σώσον με ο Θεό. Ότι σε πάταξε πάντα στου εχθρένοντά με ματέω, ο δόντα αμαρτωλών συνέτριψα. Του κυρίου η σωτηρία και επί των λαών σου ευλογία σου. Εγώ εκοιμήθην και ύπνοσα, εξηγέρθην ότι Κύριο αντιλήψετε μου. O Lord, do not rebuke me in your wrath, nor chasten me in your anger, for your arrows are fixed in me, and your hand rests on me. There is no healing in my flesh because of your wrath. There is no peace in my hope because of my sins. Through my transgressions, you rise up over my head like a heavy burden. They are heavy upon me. My wounds grow foul and fester because of my folly. I suffer misery and am utterly bowed down. I go all the day long with a sad face, for my loins are filled with mockeries. And there is no healing in my flesh. I am afflicted and greatly humbled. I roar because of the groaning of my heart. O Lord, all my desire is before you, and my groaning is not hidden from you. My heart is troubled, my strength fails me, and the light of my eyes, even this, is not with me. My friends and neighbors draw near and stand against me, and my near of kin stand far off. And those who seek my soul use violence, and those who seek evil for me speak folly. And they meditate on deceit all the day long. But I, like a deaf man, do not hear, and I am like a mute who does not open his mouth. I am like a man who does not hear and who has no reproofs in his mouth. For in you, O Lord, I hope, I you will hear, O Lord my God. For I said, Let not my enemies rejoice over me. For when my foot was shaken, they boasted against me. For I am ready for wounds, and my pain is continually with me. For I will declare my transgression, and I will be anxious about my sin. But my enemies live and are becoming stronger than I, and those who hate me unjustly are multiplied. Those who repaid me evil for good slandered me because I pursue righteousness, and they threw away my love as though it were a stinking corpse. Do not forsake me, O Lord, O my God. Do not depart from me. Give heed to help me, O Lord of my salvation. 
Do not forsake me, O Lord, O my God, do not depart from me. Give heed to help me, O Lord of my salvation. O Θεός μου, ο Θεός μου, προς Θεορθρίζω, δίψε με η ψυχή μου, πως απλώς η σάρξ μου εν γη ερήμο και αβάτο και ανίδρο ούτου εν το Αγίο όφθην σου του ειδήν την δύναμή σου και τη δόξα σου, ότι κρίσον το ελαιό σου υπέρ ζωάς, τα χείλη μου επανέσως έσυ, ούτως ευλογήσω σε εν τη ζωή μου και το όνομα της σου άρωτας χείρες μου, ως αξιτέατος και ποιότητος εμπλεστεί η ψυχή μου και χείλη αγαλλιάσιος, ενέσυ το στόμα μου, ή εμνημόνευόν σου επί της τρόμνης μου εν τσόρθισο μελέτων σε, ότι έγινε της βοηθός μου και εν τη σκέπη των πτερήγων σου αγαλλιάσομαι. Εκολύθη η ψυχή μου ο πίσω μου, εμού δε αντιλάβει το δεξιά σου. Αυτή δε εις μάτιαν, εις μάτιν εζήτησαν την ψυχή μου, εις ελεύσονται εις τα κατώτατα της γης, παραδοθήσονται εις χέρας τρομφέας, μέριδες αλλοπέκων έσονται, ο δε βασιλεύς εφρανθήσετε επί το Θεό, επενηθήσετε πάσο όμνιον αυτό, Ότι ενεφράγει στο μαλαλούν τον άδικα. Εν τη όρθρη σε μελέτων ει αιώ, ότι εγινήθη βοηθό μου και εν τη σκεπή των πτερήγων σου αγαλιάσομαι. Εκολύθη η ψυχή μου ο πίσω σου εμού δε αντελάβε το δεξιά σου. Δόξα πατρί και αιώ και αγίο πνεύματι και νυν και αιαν και ει του αιώνα των αιώνων αμήν. Αλληλούια, 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 δόξα σε Θεό. Αλληλούια, 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 δόξα σε Θεό. Αλληλούια, 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 δόξα σε Θεό. Κύριε Λαϊσόν, κύριε Λαϊσόν, κύριε Λαϊσόν. Δόξα πατρί και αιώ και αγίο πνεύματι και νυν και αιν. Και ει του αιώνα των αιώνων αμήν. O Lord God of my salvation, I cry day and night before you. Let my prayer come before you, and climb your ear to my supplication, O Lord. For my soul is filled with sorrows, and my soul draws near to Hades. I am counted among those who go down into the pit. I am like a helpless man, free among the dead, like slain men thrown down and sleeping in a grave whom you remember no more. But they are removed from your hand. They laid me in the lowest pit, in dark places and in the shadow of death. Your wrath rested upon me, and you brought all your billows over me. You removed my acquaintances far from me. They made me an abomination among themselves. I was betrayed and did not go forth. My eyes weakened from poverty. O oh Lord, I cry to you the whole day long. I spread out my hands to you. Will you work wonders for the dead, or will physicians raise them up and acknowledge you? Shall anyone in the grave describe your mercy and your truth and destruction? Shall your wonders be known in darkness, and your righteousness in a forgotten land? But I cry to you, O Lord, and in the morning my prayer shall come near to you. Why, O Lord, do you reject my soul, and turn away your face from me? I am poor and in troubles from my youth, but having been exalted, I was humbled and brought into despair. Your fierce anger passed over me, and your terrors greatly troubled me. They compassed me like water all the day long. They surrounded me at once. You removed far from me my neighbor and my friend, and my acquaintances because of my misery. O Lord God of my salvation, I cry day and night before you. Let my prayer come before you, and climb your ear to my supplication, O Lord. Ευλόγη η ψυχή μου τον Κύριο και πάντα τα εντό μου το όνομα το Άγιον αυτού. Ευλόγη η ψυχή μου τον Κύριο και μη επιλάνθου πάσα στα ανταποδόσει αυτού. Τον ευηλατεύοντα πάσα στου ανομίε μου. Τον ιόμενων πάσα στου νόσου σου. Τον λυτρούμενων εκθορά στην ζωή σου. Τον στεφανούντα ένε λέει και εκτερμή. Τον εμπιμπλώντα εν αγαθή στην επιθυμία σου. Ανακινίστε σε όσα ητού είναι ότι σου. Ποιόν ελεημοσύνο ο Κύριο και κρίμα πάση τη δικουμένη. Εγνώρισε τα σου αυτού του Μωησί τη ει 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 Ισραήλ τα θελήματα αυτού. Εκτήρμον και ελεήμον ο Κύριο μακρότιμο και πολύ Έλεο, ου και στέλο οργίσεστε, ου δέει στον αιώνα μην ει, ου κατά τα σανομία σημών επίη εν ημέν, δε κατά τα σαμαρτία σημών αντεπέδο και εν ημίν, ότι κατά το ύψο του ουρανού από τη γη σε κρατέωσε κύριο το έλεο αυτού επί του φοβωμένου αυτών, καθώ ο να απέχουσεν ανατολέ από δυσμών, εμάκρυνε αφημώντα σανομία σημών, καθώ η κτήρη πατήριου ο κτέρισε κύριο του φοβωμένου αυτών, ότι αυτό έγνοτο πλάσμα ημών εμνίστε ο τυχού έσμεν. Άνθρωπο, ο Σι Χόρτο, η ημέρα αυτού, ο Σι Ανθό του Αγρού, του εξανθίσει, ότι πνεύμα διήλθωνε εν αυτό και ούχη υπάρξει και ούχη επιγνώσεται επί τον τόπο αυτού, το δε έλεο του κυρίου από το αιώνο και έω το αιώνο επί του φοβουμένου αυτών και η δικαιοσύνη αυτού επί ίσιον τη φυλάσσωση στη διαθήκη αυτού και μεμνημένη των εντολών αυτού του ποιήσε αυτά. Κύριο εν το ουρανό ετοίμασε τον θρόνο αυτού και η βασιλεία αυτού πάντων δεσπόζει. Ευλογείται τον κύριο πάντε οι άγγελοι αυτού. Δυνατή ισχύ ποιούντα τον λόγο αυτού, του ακούσε τι φωνέ των λόγων αυτού. Ευλογείται τον κύριο Πάσα, η δυνάμει αυτού, λειτουργεί αυτού, ποιούντα το θέλημα αυτού. Ευλογείται τον κύριο Πάντα τα έργα αυτού, εν παντήτω από τη δεσποτεία αυτού. Ευλόγη η ψυχή μου τον κύριο. Εν παντήτω από τη δεσποτεία αυτού. Ευλόγη η ψυχή μου τον κύριο. Ο Lord, hear my prayer. Give ear to my supplication in your truth. Answer me in your righteousness. Do not enter into judgment with your servant. For no one living shall become righteous in your sight. For the enemy persecuted my soul. He humbled my life to the ground. 
He caused me to dwell in dark places as one long dead, and my spirit was in anguish within me. My heart was troubled within me. I remembered the days of old, and I meditated on all of your works. I meditated on the works of your hands. I spread out my hands to you. My soul thirsts for you like a waterless land. Hear me speedily, O Lord. My spirit faints within me. Turn not your face from me, lest I become like those who go down into the pit. Cause me to hear your mercy in the morning, for I hope in you. Make me know, O Lord, the way wherein I should walk, for I lift up my soul to you. Deliver me from my enemies, O Lord, for to you I flee for refuge. Teach me to do your will, for you are my God. Your good spirit shall guide me in the land of a brightness. For your name's sake, O Lord, give me life. In your righteousness you shall bring my soul out of affliction, and your mercy you shall destroy my enemies. You shall utterly destroy all who afflict my soul, for I am your servant. Answer me in your righteousness, O Lord, do not enter into judgment with your servant. Answer me in your righteousness, O Lord, do not enter into judgment with your servant. Your good spirit shall guide me in the land of a brightness. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, O God. Alleluia, 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 glory to you, O God. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. Glory to you, O God, our <coughs> hope, O Lord, glory to you. In peace, let us pray to the Lord. O Lord, have mercy. For the peace from above and the salvation of our souls, let us pray to the Lord. O Lord, have mercy. For peace in the whole world, for the stability of the holy churches of God, and for the unity of all, let us pray to the Lord. O Lord, have mercy. For this holy house and for those who enter it with faith, Reverence and the fear of God, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For pious and orthodox Christians, let us pray to the Lord. For Archbishop and Father Savas, the Honorable Presbyterate, for the Diaconate in Christ, for all the clergy and the people, let us pray to the Lord. For our country, for the President, for all those in public service, and for the armed forces everywhere, let us pray to the Lord. For this city, for every city and land, and for the faithful who live in them, let us pray to the Lord. For favorable weather, for an abundance of the fruits of the earth, and for peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For those who travel by land, sea, and air, for the sick, the suffering, the captives, and for their salvation, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For our deliverance from all affliction, wrath, danger, and necessity, and from the peril of the coronavirus against us, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. <coughs> for our brethren, those who lead the fight against the coronavirus, the doctors, the medical workers, and the scientists, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. <coughs> Help us, save us, have mercy on us. And protect us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. Commemorating our all-holy, pure, most blessed and glorious Lady, the Theotokos and ever-Virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commend ourselves and one another and our whole life to Christ our God. To you, O Lord. For to you belong all glory, honor, and worship to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever and to the ages of ages. Mm -hmm. Amen. My spirit rises early in the morning to you, O God, for your commands are light upon the earth. Sini mathe de enicunde se pitis gis alilo oia alilo oia alilo. Jealousy will seize an untaught people, 
and now fire will devour the adversaries. Alleluia. Alleluia. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. 
Christ, the Tassir, the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. The reading is from the Holy Gospel according to John. Glory to you, Lord, glory to you. The Lord said to his disciples, Now is the Son of Man glorified, and in him God is glorified. If God is glorified in him, God will also glorify him in himself, and glorify him at once. Little children, yet a little while I am with you. You will seek me, and as I said to the Jews, so now I say to you, where I am going, you cannot come. A new commandment I give to you, that you love one another, even as I have loved you, that you also love one another. By this all men will know that you are my disciples, if you have love for one another. Simon Peter said to him, Lord, where are you going? Jesus answered, where I am going, you cannot follow me now, but you shall follow afterward. Peter said to him, Lord, why can I not follow you now? I will lay down my life for you. Jesus answered, Will you lay down your life for me? <laughs> truly, truly, I say to you, the cock will, no, will not crow until you have denied me three times. Let, your, let not your hearts be troubled. Believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many rooms. If it were not so, would I have told you that I go to prepare a place for you? And when I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and take you to myself, that where I am you may be also. And you know the way where I am going. Thomas said to him, Lord, we do not know where you are going. How can we know the way? Jesus said to him, I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father but by me. If you had known me, you would have known my Father also. Henceforth you know him and have seen him. Philip said to him, Lord, show us the Father and we shall be satisfied. Jesus said to him, have I been with you so long <clears throat> and you do not know me, Philip? He who has seen me has seen the Father. How can you say, show us the Father? Do you not believe that I am in the Father and the Father in me? The words I say to you, I do not speak on my own authority, but the Father who dwells in me does his works. Believe me that I am in the Father and the Father in me, or else believe me for the sake of the works themselves. Truly, truly, I say to you, he who believes in me will also do the works that I do, and greater works than these will he do, because I go to the Father. Whatever you ask in my name, I will do it, that the Father may be glorified in the Son. If you ask anything in my name, I will do it. If you love me, you will keep my commandments, and I will ask the Father, and he will give you another counselor to be with you forever, even the Spirit of truth whom the world cannot receive, because it neither sees him nor knows him. You know him, for he dwells with you and, and will be in you. I will not leave you desolate. I will come to you yet a little while, and the world will see me no more, but you will see me because I live. You will live also. In that day you will know that I am in my Father, and you in me, and I in you. He who has my commandments and keeps them, he it is who loves me. And he who loves me will be loved by my Father, and I will love him and manifest myself to him. Judas, not Iscariot, said to him, Lord, how is it that you will manifest yourself to us and not to the world? Jesus answered him, If a man loves me, he will keep my word, and my Father will love him. And we will come to him and make our home with him. He who does not love me does not keep my words. And the word which you hear is not mine, but the Father's who sent me. These things I have spoken to you while I am still with you. But the Counselor, the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, he will teach you all things and bring to your remembrance all that I have said to you. Peace I leave with you. My peace I give to you. Not as the world do I give to you. Let not your hearts be troubled. Neither let them be afraid. You have heard me said, I go away and I will come to you. If you loved me, you would have rejoiced. Because I go to the Father, for the Father is greater than I. And now I have told you before it takes place, so that when it does take place, you may believe. I will no longer talk much with you, for the ruler of this world is coming. He has no power over me, but I do as the Father has commanded me, so that the world may know that I love the Father. Rise, let us go hence. I am the true vine, and my Father is the vine dresser. Every branch of mine that bears no fruit, he takes away, and every branch that does bear fruit, he prunes that it may bear more fruit. You are already made clean by the word which I have spoken to you. Abide in me, and I in you, as the branch cannot bear fruit by itself unless it abides in the vine. Neither can you, unless you abide in me. I am the vine, you are the branches. He who abides in me, and I in him, he it is that bears much fruit. For apart from me, you can do nothing." If a man does not abide in me, he is cast forth as a branch and withers. And the branches are gathered, thrown into the fire, and burned. 
If you abide in me and my words abide in you, ask whatever you will, and it shall be done for you. By this my Father is glorified, that you bear much fruit, and so prove to be my disciples. As the Father has loved me, so I have loved you. Abide in my love. If you keep my commandments, you will abide in my love, just as I have kept my Father's commandments, and abide in his love. These things I have spoken to you, that my joy may be in you, and that your joy may be full. This is my commandment, that you love one another as I have loved you. Greater love is no man than this, that a man lays down his life for his friends. You are my friends, if you do what I command you. No longer do I call you servants, for the servant does not know what his master is doing, but I have called you friends. For all that I have heard from my Father, I have made known to you. You did not choose me, but I chose you and appointed you, that you should go and bear fruit, and that your fruit should abide, so that whatever you ask the Father in my, my name, he may give it to you. This I command, that you love one another. If the world hates you, know that it has hated me before it hated you. If you were of the world, the world would love its own. But because you are not of the world, but I chose you out of the world, therefore the world hates you. Remember the word that I said to you, a servant is not greater than his master. If they persecuted me, they will persecute you. If they kept my word, they will keep yours also. But all this they will do to you on my account, because they do not know him who sent me. If I had not come and spoken to them, they would not have sinned. But now they have no excuse for their sin. He who hates me hates my father also. If I had not done among them the works which no one else did, they would not have sinned. But now they have seen and hated both me and my father. It is to fulfill the word that is written in, the law, in their law. <clears throat> they hated me without a cause. But when the counselor comes, whom I shall send to you from the father, even the spirit of truth who proceeds from the father, he will bear witness to me. And you also are witnesses. Because you have been with me from the beginning. I have said all of this to keep you from falling away. They will put you out of the synagogues. Indeed, the hour is coming when whoever kills you will think he is offering service to God. And they will do this because they have not known the Father nor me. But I have said these things to you that when their hour comes, you may remember that I told you of them. I did not say these things to you from the beginning because I was with you. But now I am going to him who sent me. Yet none of you ask me, where are you going? But because I have said these things to you, sorrow has filled your hearts. Nevertheless, I tell you the truth. It is to your advantage that I go away. For if I do not go away, the counselor will not come to you. But if I go, I will send him to you. And when he comes, he will convince the world concerning sin and righteousness and judgment. Concerning sin, because they do not believe in me. Concerning righteousness, because I go to the Father and you will see me no more. Concerning judgment, because the ruler of this world is judged. I have yet many things to say to you, but you cannot bear them now. When the spirit of truth comes, he will guide you into all truth, for he will not speak on his own authority, but whatever he hears, he will speak. And he will declare to you the things that are to come. He will glorify me, for he will take what is mine and declare it to you. All that the Father has is mine. Therefore, I said that he will take what is mine and declare it to you. A little while and you will see me no more. Again, in a little while and you will see me. Some of, his, some of his disciples said to one another, What is this that he says to us? A little while and you will not see me. And again, a little while and you will see me. And because I go to the Father. They said, What does he mean by a little while? We do not know what he means. Jesus knew that they wanted to ask him, so he said to them, Is this what you are asking yourselves? What I meant by saying a little while and you will not see me and again a little while and you will see me? Truly, truly, I say to you, you will weep and lament, but the world will rejoice. You will be sorrowful, but your sorrow will turn into joy. When a woman is in travail, she has sorrow because her hour has come. But when she is delivered of the child, she no longer remembers the anguish for joy that a child is born into the world. So you have sorrow now, but I will see you again, and your hearts will rejoice. And no one will take your joy from you. In that day you will ask nothing of me. Truly, truly, I say to you, if you ask anything of the Father, he will give it to you in my name. Hitherto you have asked nothing in my name. Ask, and you will receive that your joy may be full. I have said this to you in figures. The hour is coming when I shall no longer speak to you in figures, but tell you plainly of the Father. In that day you will ask in my name, and I do not say that, you, that I shall ask the Father for you, for the Father himself loves you, because you have loved me. And I've believed that I came from the Father. 
I came from the Father, and I have come into the world again. I am leaving the world and going to the Father. His disciples said, Ah, now you are speaking plainly, not in any figure. Now we know that you know all things and need none to question you. By this we believe that you came from God. Jesus answered them, Do you now believe? The hour is coming indeed, it has come, when you will be scattered, every man to his home, and will leave me alone. Yet I am not alone, for the Father is with me. I have said this to you, that in me you may have peace. In the world you have tribulation, but be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. When Jesus had spoken these words, he lifted up his eyes to heaven and said, Father, the hour has come. Glorify your Son, that the Son may glorify you, since you have given him power over all flesh to give eternal life to all whom you have given him. And this is eternal life, that they know you, the only true God, and Jesus Christ whom you have sent. I have glorified you on earth, I, having accomplished the work which you gave me to do. And now, Father, glorify me in your own presence with the glory which, which I had with you before the world was made. I have manifested your name to the men whom you gave me out of the world. Yours they were, and you gave them to me, and they have kept your word. Now they know that everything you have given me is from you, for I have given them the words which you gave me. And they have received them and know in truth that I came from you. And they have believed that you did send me. I am praying for them. I'm not praying for the world, but for those whom you have given me. Your, for they are yours. All mine are yours. And yours are mine, and I am glorified in them. And now I am no more in the world, but they are in the world, and I am coming to you. Holy Father, keep them in your name which you have given me, that they may be one, even as we are one. While I was with them, I kept them in your name, which you have given me. I have guarded them, and none of them is lost, but the son of perdition, that the scripture might be fulfilled. But now I am coming to you in these things. I speak in the world, that they may have my joy fulfilled in themselves. I have given them your word, and the world has hated them, because they are not of the world, even as I am not of the world. I do not pray that you should take them out of the world, but that you should keep them from the evil one. They are not of the world, even as I am not of the world. Sanctify them in the truth. Your word is truth. As you did send me into the world, so I have sent them into the world. And for their sake I consecrate myself, that they may also be consecrated in truth. I do not pray for these only, but also for those who believe in me through their word. That they may all be one, even as you, Father, in me, and I in you. That they also may be in us so that the world may believe that you have sent me. The glory which you have given me, I have given to them, that they may be one even as we are one. I and them, and you and me, that they may be perfectly one, so that the world may know that you have sent me, and have loved, and have loved them even as you have loved me. Father, I desire that they also whom you have given me may be with me wherever I am, to behold my glory, which you have given me in your love before the foundation of the Lord. O oh, righteous Father, the world has not known you, but I have known you, and these know that you have sent me. I have made known to them your name, and I will make it known that the love which, with which you have loved me may be in them, and I in them. When Jesus had spoken these words, <coughs> forth with his disciples across the Kidron Valley where there was a garden which he and his disciples entered. Glory to your forbearance, the Lord, glory to you. Now I give the rulers of the people gather together against the Lord and against his anointed. Λόγων παρανόμων κατέθεν το κάτε μου Κύριε, Κύριε, μη εγκαταλείπεις με Let us present our senses pure to Christ and as his friends Let us lay down our lives for him 
Let us not, like Judas, be choked by the cares of life, but in our rooms let us cry, Our Father who art in heaven, deliver us from evil. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O Mary Theodorus, as a virgin, you gave birth, and we made the virgin. O chaste and unwedded mother, pray to Christ our God to save us. Pedra me lego noi, udas dis para nomis gramatepsi. Ti mi thelete dune kago imin para doso afton. En meso de ton sinfonundon, aftos istikes aorato sinfonu muenos, cardiognos da fise tom sihonimon. Let us serve God with compassion like Mary did at the supper, and let us not acquire loyal for money like Judas did, so that we may always be with Christ our God. Δόξα Πατρί και Υιό και Αγίο Πνεύματι και Νύν και Αΐν και εις τους αιώνας των αιώνων αμήν Πονέτε και σπαρθένε ανερμηνεύτος δια παντός ως φιλάνθρωπος Μη διαλείπεις δυσοπούσα ή να κινδύνουν σώσε τους είσαι καταφεύγοντας The Hebrew children cried out, O Son, unto you for raising Lazarus, O Lord, who loves humanity, but Judas, the transgressor, did not wish to understand. At your supper, O Christ God, you predicted to your disciples, one of you will betray me, but Judas, the transgressor, did not wish to understand. Ioanni erotisan de Kyrie, o paradidus etis esti, tu tu deo tu ardu ipedixas, o de paranomos iudas, uki vulithis siniene. Sought to kill you, O Lord, with thirty pieces of silver and a deceitful kiss. But Judas, the transgressor, did not wish to understand. At the washing of feet, O Christ God, you exhorted your disciples, do as you have seen. But Judas the transgressor did not wish to understand. Grigorite ke prosevjeste in ami pirastite, tis mathite su o Theos imon eleges, o de paranomos iudas uki vulithis in iene. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but now and ever, and to the ages of ages of man. Deliver us, your humble servants, from peril, so Theotokos asks for refuge after God. We all flee to you, an impregnable fortress and protection. Um, during the supper, when you were feeding the disciples, knowing the pretext of the betrayal, you exposed Judas, and you knew that he was incorrigible. But you wanted everyone to know that it was your will to surrender, so that you could snatch the world from the enemy. O oh, long-suffering Lord, glory to you. Let us pray to the Lord our God that we may be worthy to the Holy Gospel. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Wisdom arise, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. The reading of the Holy Gospel according to St. John. Let us be attentive. Glory to you, O Lord, glory to you. At that time, Jesus went forth with his disciples across the King of Valley, where there was a garden which he had a disciple until now Judas was betrayed him, also knew the place, for Jesus often met there with his disciples. 
So Judah persuaded a band of soldiers and some officers from the chief priests and the Pharisees when there with lanterns and torch and weapons. Then Jesus, knowing all that was to befall him, came forward and said to them, Who do you seek? They answered him, Jesus of Nazareth. Jesus said to them, I am he. Judas, who betrayed him, was standing with them. When he said to them, I am he, they drew back and fall to the ground. Again he asked him, Whom do you see? And they said, Jesus of Nazareth. Jesus answered, I told you that I am he. So if you seek me, let these men go. This was to fulfill the word which he had spoken. Of course, whom you have me, I lost. I have not one. Then Simon Peter, having a sword, drew it and stuck the high priest's slave and cut off his right ear. The slave name Nicholas Jesus said to Peter, Put your sword into the its heat. Shall I not drink, drink the cup which the Father was giving me? So the head of soldiers and their captain and the officer of the Jews seized Jesus and bound him. First they led him to an ass, for he was the father of Caphas, who was high priest. That year it was Caiaphas who had given counsel of the Jews that he was expending that one man should die for the people. Simon Peter followed Jesus and so did another disciple. As this disciple was known to the high priest, he entered the court of the high priest along with Jesus while Peter stood outside the door, so the other disciple, who was known to the high priest, went out and spoke to the maid who kept the door and threw Peter him. The maid, the maid who kept the door said to Peter, Are not you also one of these men? Disciple, he said, I am not. Now the servants and officers made a charcoal fire because it was cold <clears throat> and they were standing and warming themselves. Peter also was with them, standing and warming himself. The high priest then questioned Jesus about his disciple and his teaching. Jesus answered him, I have spoken openly to the world. I have always taught in synagogue and in the temple where all Jews come together. I have said nothing secretly. Why do you ask me as those who have heard me what I said to them? They knew I had what I said when he had said this. One of the officers standing by stuck Jesus with his hand saying, is that how you answer the high priest? Jesus answered him, If I have spoken wrongly, bear witness to the wrong. But if I have spoken rightly, why do you strike me? And us then sent him bound to Caphaeus, the high priest. Now Simon Peter was standing and warming himself. They said to him, uh, one of the servants of the high priest, a kinsman of the man whose, whose ear Peter had cut off, asked, Did I not see you in the garden with him? Peter again denied it, and at, at once the cock crowed. Then they led Jesus from the house of fires to the Patreon. It was early. They themselves did not enter the property home, so though they might not be the field, but might the Passover. Peace be to you who proclaims the good news. Glory to your forbearance, O Lord, glory to you. And on us today to... 
<coughs> to the Judas forsakes the teacher and takes to himself the devil. He is blinded by the passion of avarice, and in his darkness he falls from the light. For all good he see who sold the guiding light. For thirty pieces of silver, money who suffered for the world has risen for us. Let us cry out to him, O Lord, who suffered for you. And with humanity, glory to you. Σήμερα ο Ιούδας παραποιείται Θεός ευβίαν και αλλού τριούνται του χαρίσματος. Υπάρχον μαθητής γίνεται προδότης εν ήδη φιλικό δόλον υποκρύπτει και προτιμάται αφρόνος της του δεσπότου αγάπης τριάκοντα αργύρια. Ο οδηγός γενομένος συνέδριου παράνομου εμείς δέχοντες σωτηρίαν των Χριστών αυτών δοξάσομεν. As brethren in Christ, let us have love for brethren and not a lack of sympathy for our neighbors, so that we may not be condemned like that servant who was mercilessly, merciless regarding his money, and gain nothing from repentance like Judas. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but not of into the ages of ages. Amen. Amen. Glorious things were said everywhere concerning you, for you gave birth in the flesh to the Maker of all, Lord and Virgin Mary Theotokos. Ο μαθητής του διδασκάλου συνεφώνει την τιμή και τριάκοντα αργυρίς πέπρα και των κυρίων φιλήματι δολίο παραδούς αυτών της ανόμησης θανάτων. Today the Creator of heaven and earth said to his disciples, The hour as it hand, and Judas who betrayed me has arrived. Let no one deny me when you see me on the cross between two robbers. For I suffer as a man and as the one who loves humanity. I save those who believe in me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but none ever into the ages of ages. Amen. O Virgin, who at the end of times inevitably conceived, and for your Creator, save those who magnify you. Σήμερον Γρηγορή ο Ιούδας παραδούνε τον Κυρίον τον πρώτον αιώνον σωτήρα του κόσμου τον εκ πέντε άρτων χορτάσαν τα πλήθη Σήμερον ο άνομος αρνείται τον διδασκάλων μαθητής γενόμενος δεσπότην παρέδοκεν Αργυρίο πέπρα και τον μάνα χορτάσαντα τον άνθρωπον. Today Jews had the Lord nailed to the cross, the Lord who parted the sea with the rod and led them into the wilderness. Today they had his side pierced with the spear, who for their sake had smitten Egypt with plagues. They gave him gall to drink, who had rained down the manna for them to eat. Ah, Lord, as you were approaching their volu your voluntary passion, 
you said to your disciples, if you cannot watch with me, even for one hour, how can you promise to die for me? Look at Judas, he is not asleep, but he is intent on betraying me to the transgressors. Rise and pray, lest anyone deny me. When he sees me on the cross, O long-suffering Lord, glory to you. Δόξα Πατρί και Υιό και Αγίο Πνευματί και νυν και αην και εις τους αιώνας των αιώνων αμήν χαίρε Θεότο και η των αχωρητών εν ουράνους χωρίς ασά εν μήτρα σου χαίρε Παρθένε των προφήτων το κήρυγμα δίνει μην έλαψε ο Εμμανουήλ χαίρε μήτρ Χριστού του Θεού What did the Savior do to you, Judas, that turned you into a traitor? Did he separate you from the company of the apostles? Did he deprive you of the gift of healing? Did he eat the supper with the others? but exclude you from the table. Did he wash the other's feet, but overlook yours? Oh, so many blessings have you forgotten, so now your ingratitude is held up to scorn, but his incomparable forbearance is everywhere proclaimed as well as his great mercy. Let us pray to the Lord our God that we may be worthy to the Holy Gospel. Glory of mercy, glory of mercy, glory of mercy. Let us arise with them, arise with us, hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. Ek tu kata matheon ayu evangelio ton agnos ma. Pros homen. Doxa si kyrie, doxa si. Tokero ekinu. Οι στρατιώτε κρατήσαντε στο Ισού απίγαγοντο και άφαν του αρχιερέα. Όπω οι γραμματεί και οι πρεσβύτεροι συνήθισαν, ο δε Πέτρο οικολούθη αυτόν από μακρόθεν έω τη αυλή του αρχιερέω. Και οι σελθόν έσω εκάθητο μετά των υπερετών. Ιδί το τέλο. Οι δε αρχιερείς και οι πρεσβύτεροι και των συνέδριων όλων εζήτουν ψευδοματηρίαν κάτω του Ιησού όπως θανατώσους είναι αυτόν και ου και εύρων και πολλών ψευμο, ψευδοματηρίων προσευθόντων ου και εύρων ύστερα δε προσευθόντος δύο ψευδοματήρες Υπον ούτως έφη δύνα, δύναμε καταλύσε τον ναόν του Θεού και δια τριών ημέρων οικοδομήσε αυτόν και να στάσω η χέρευς είπεν αυτόν ουδέν αποκρίνει τη ούτη σου κατά μαρτυρούσιν ο δε Ιησούς Ισιώπα και αποκριθείς ο αρχιερεύς είπεν αυτόν εξοκρίζω, εξοκρίζω σε κατά του Θεού του ζώντος ή να ημίν ήπεις εσύ ή ο η Χριστός ο Υιός του Θεού λέγει αυτό Ιησούς σύ είπας πριν λέγω ημίν απάρτη όψεσθε του, του Υιού του ανθρώπου καθημένων εκ δεξιών της δυνάμεως και ερχόμενων επί των εφελών του ουρανού. Τότε ο αρχιερεύς διέριξε τα ημάτια αυτού, λέγω ότι <coughs> ευλασφήμισε τι έχει κρύαν έχων μαρτύρων. Ήδεν ήκουσατε του η βλασφημία αυτού, τι ημίδοκοι, Είδε αποκριθέντε ύπων ένοχο θανάτου εστί. Τούτε ενέπτωσαν ει των πρόσωπων αυτού και κολάφησαν αυτόν. Είδε αράπησαν λέγοντε 
προφήτευσον ημίν Χριστέ τι έστι ο πέσασε ο δε Πέτρος έξω εκάθητο εν τη αυλή και προσήλθεν αυτό μία παιδί σκυλέγουσα και εσύ είστα μετά Ιησού του Γαλιλαίου ο δε ηρνήσα το έμπρος εν αυτόν πάντο λέγον ουκ είδα τι λέγεις εξερθώνται δε αυτόν εις τον πολλών αείδιν αυτόν άλλοι και λέγει της εκείν και ούτως ειν μετά Ιησού του Ναζαρέου και πάλιν γυρνήσα το με θόρκου και ότι ουκ είδα το άνθρωπον μετά μικρόν δε προσελθώντες ή εστώτες είπων το πρέτρο αληθώς και εσύ εξ αυτών ή και γάρ η λαλιά σου δηλώσε πει τότε ήρξα το κατά θαματίζειν και ομήν ότι είδα τον άνθρωπο <coughs> και ευθέως αλέκτορ εφώνησε και μίστη ο Πέτρος του, ρήμα, του, του ρήματος του Ιησού ηρήκοντος ήρ, αυτό ότι πριν ελέκτορα φωνήσε της απαρνήσιμε και εξερθών έξω έκλαψε μικρό Δόξα τη μακρόθυμία σου Κύριε δόξα σύ Even though you struck the shepherd and scattered the sheep, namely my twelve disciples, I could summon more than twelve legions of angels. But I forbear so that the unknown and secret things that I showed you through my prophets may be fulfilled. Glory to you, Lord. Τρίτον αρνησάμενος ο Πέτρος, ευθέως το ρηθέν αυτούς ηνίκεν, αλλά προσήγαγε εσύ δάκρυα μετανοίας, ο Θεός ηλάστη τιμή και σώσον με. Glory to the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit, both now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Let us all praise the Holy Virgin as the gateway to salvation, as a paradise of delight, as a cloud of the everlasting light, and let us say to her, Rejoice. Mm, now as all transgressors of the law, what did you hear from our Savior? Did he not explain the law and teachings of mm. the prophets? So what was your reason for delivering to Pilate God the word from God and the Redeemer of our souls? Σταυρωθή το έκραζον, ήτον σον χαρίσμα των αιέν τρυφώντες και κακούργον αντεβεργέ του ήτουν το λαβήν ήτον δικαίων φωνευτές οι όπας δε Χριστέ φέρον αυτόν την προπέτειαν Παθήν θέλον και σώσε ημάς ως φιλάνθρωπος. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Since we have no right to speak because of our many sins, O Virgin Theotokos, implore him who was born of you for the prayer of a mother, can do much to win the Master's favor. 
O Lady, do not despise the entreaties of us sinners, for he who condescended to suffer for us is merciful and able to save us. Why, they weighed on the thirty pieces of silver, <laughs> the price of him on whom a price had been set by some of the sons of Israel. Watch and pray that you may not enter into temptation. Spirit indeed is willing, but the flesh is weak, therefore watch. Edo kanis to vroma mu cholin, ke is din dipsan mu epotisan me oxos. Si de kiri e anastison me, ke anda podos of this. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. We of the Gentiles sing praise to you, O pure Theotokos, for you gave birth to Christ our God, who through you freed mankind from the curse. Oh yeah, how could Judas, who was once your disciple, turn against you and meditate your betrayal? Unrighteous traitor, he deceitfully sat at supper with you. He had gone to the priest and said, What will you give to me if to you I deliver him? Who broke the law and profane the Sabbath? O long suffering Lord, glory to you. Let us pray to the Lord our God that we may be worthy to hear the Holy Gospel. Oh Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Our God is the Lord, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. The reading of the Holy Gospel according to St. John. Let us be attentive. Glory that to you, O Lord, glory to you. Then Jesus from the house of Caiaphas to the Praetorium, it was early, yet they himself did not enter the Praetorium, so that they may might not be the field, but might eat the Passover. So Pilate went out to them and said, What? Accusation, do you bring against this man? They answered him, If this man were not an Evildorgo, we would not have handed him over. Pilate said to them, Take him yourselves and judge him by your own law. The Jews said to him, It is not lawful for us to put any man to death. This was to fulfill the word what Jesus has spoken to show by what death he was to die. Pilate entered the praetorium again and called Jesus and said to him, Are you the king of the Jews? Jesus answered, Do you say this of your own accord? Or did others say it to you about me? Pilate answered, uh, Am I a Jew, your own nation and the chief? The priests have handed you over to me. What have you done? Jesus answered, My kinship is not of this world. If, uh, if my kinship were of this world, my servants would fight that I might not be handed over to the Jews. But my king kinship is not from the world. Pilate said to him, So, you are a king, Jesus answered, you say that am I a king, for this I was born, and for this I have come into the world to bear witness to the truth. Everyone who is of the truth hears my voice. Pilate said to him, what is the truth? After he had said this, he went out to the Jews again. I did, and told them, I find no crime in him, but you have a custom that I should release one, of, one man for you of the Passover. Will you have me release for you the king of the Jews? They cried out again, not this man, but Barabbas. 
Now wherever else was a robber, then Pilate took Jesus and screwed him, and the soldier laid a crown of thorns and put it on his head, and arrived him in a purple robe. They came up to him, saying, Hail, King of the Jews, and struck him with their hands. Pilate went out again and said to them, See, I am bringing him out to you, that you may know that I find no crime in him. So Jesus came out wearing the crown of throne and the purple robe. Pilate said to them, Behold the man, when the chief priests and the officers saw him, they cried out, Crucify him, crucify him. Pilate said to them, Take him yourself and crucify him, for I find no crime in him. The Jews answered him, We have the law, and by the law he ought to die, because he has made himself the Son of God. When Pilate heard his word, he, has the more af- he was the more afraid that he entered the praetorium again and said to Jesus, Where are you from? But Jesus gave no answer. Pilate therefore said to him, You will not speak to me. Do you not know that I have power to release you and power to crucify you? Jesus answered him, You would have no power over me unless it had been given you from above. Therefore he will deliver me to you as the greater sin. Upon this pirate sought to release him, but the Jews cried out, If you release this man, you are not Caesar, friend. Everyone who makes himself a king sets himself against Caesar. When Pilate heard these words, he brought Jesus out and sat down on the judgment seat at the place called the pavement, and in Hebrew, Kabbatha. Now it was the day of preparation of Passover. It was about the sixth hour. He said to the Jews, Behold your king. They cry out, Away with him, away with him, crucify him. Pilate said to them, Shall I crucify your king? The chief priest answered, We have no king but Caesar. Then he handed him over to them to be crucified. Glory to your forbearance, O Lord, glory to you. Covers himself with light as with a garment, stood naked in judgment. He received the blows to the cheeks from the hands he had fashioned. And the unlawful people had the Lord of glory nailed to the cross. Then the veil of the temple was torn in two, and the sun hid itself, unable to wash this insult to God. Before whom the universe trembles, let us worship him. O Mathitis, your knees at all, is this a voice? Nistiti Mukirie and the Vasilia Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Grant peace to the world, O Lord, who for your servant's sake accepted to wear flesh from the Virgin, so that with one voice we might glorify you, who love humanity. And the agathon, O 
τον επίζας Χριστέ, το γέννη των Εβραίων, σταυρωθήνε σε κατεδίκασον, όξος και χολήν σε ποτίσαντες, αλλά δώσ' αυτής Κύριε κατά τα έργα αυτών, ότι ουξυνήκαν την συν συγκατάβαση. The Hebrews were not content that you were betrayed, O Christ, but they shook their heads, bringing scorn and mockery. But you, O Lord, give them according to their works, for they meditated on vain things against you. Neither the earth as it quaked, nor the rocks as they split, neither the veil of the temple, nor the raising of the dead convinced the Jews, but you, O Lord, gave them according to their works, for they meditated on vain things against you. Doxa Patrike Ioge Agio Pnevmati Θεόν εξού σαρκωθέντα, έγνομεν παρθένε Θεό το και μόνοι αγνοί, μόνοι ευλογημένοι, δύο απόψτος εάν υμνούντες μεγαλύνομεν. Νεάγια, νεάγια, Thy says the Lord to the Jews, All my people, what have I done to you? How have I upset you? I gave sight to your boy, I cleansed your lepers, I raised the man who lay paralyzed on his bed. All my people, what have I done to you? And how have I repaid? And how have you repaid me? Instead of man, now you fed me gold. Instead of water, you gave me vinegar. Instead of loving me, you nailed me to the cross. So I will no longer hold back, but I will call my Gentiles and they will glorify me and the Father and the Spirit and I will grant them eternal life. Σήμερον του ναού το καταπέτασμα εις έλεγχον ρηγνείτε των παρανόμων και τα σιδεία σακτίνα ο ήλιο κρύπτει. Δεσπότην ώρων σταυρούμενων. O lawmakers of Israel, Judeans and Pharisees, the chorus of apostles crawls out to you. Behold the temple that you destroyed. Behold the Lamb that you crucified. You delivered him to the grave, but he has risen by his own power. Do not deceive yourself, Judeans, for he is the one who saved you in the sea and fed you in the desert. He is the life and the light and the peace of the world. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, but not ever into the ages of ages. Amen. Rejoice, O gateway of the King of glory, only the Most High passed to you for the salvation of our souls and again left you sealed. O te pares distokai avaos, ke pare do disto pilato o kriti. 
της εωρανία δυνάμεις εκ του φόβου εσαλευθήσαν τότε δε και υψώθης επί του ξύλου εν μεσοδί όλιστον και λογίστης μετά νόμων ο αναμάρτητος διά των σώσετων άνθρωπων ανεξήκα και κύριε δόξα σύ Let us pray to the Lord our God that we will be worthy to the Holy Gospel. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. With the Marais, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. The reading is from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Let us attend. Glory to you, O Lord, glory to you. At that time, when Judas, his betrayer, saw that he was condemned, he repented and brought back the 30 pieces of silver to the chief priests and the elders, saying, I have sinned in betraying innocent blood. They said, what is, it, what is that to us? See to it yourself. And throwing down the pieces of silver in the temple, he departed, and he went and hanged himself. But the chief priests, taking the pieces of silver, said, It is not lawful to put them into the treasury, since they are blood money. So they took counsel and bought with them the potter's field to bury strangers in. Therefore, that field has been called the field of blood to this day. Then was fulfilled what had been spoken by the prophet Jeremiah, saying, And they took the thirty pieces of silver, the price on him, on whom a price had been set by some of the sons of Israel. And they gave them for the potter's field, as the Lord directed me. Now Jesus stood before the governor, and the governor asked him, Are you the king of the Jews? Jesus said, You have said so. But when, we, when he was accused by the chief priests and the elders, he made no answer. Then Pilate said to him, Do you not hear how many things they testify against you? But he gave him no answer, not even to a single charge, so that the governor wondered greatly. Now, that, now at the feast, the governor was accustomed to release for the crowd any one prisoner whom they wanted. And they had then a notorious prisoner called Barabbas. So when they had gathered, Pilate said to them, Whom do you want me to release for you, Barabbas or Jesus who is called Christ? For he knew that it was out of envy that they had delivered him up. Besides, while he was sitting on the judgment seat, his wife sent word to him, Have nothing to do with that righteous man, for I have suffered much over him today in a dream. Now the chief priests and the elders persuaded the people to ask for Barabbas and destroy Jesus. The governor again said to them, Which of the two do you want me to release for you? And they said, Barabbas. Pilate said to them, Then what shall I do with Jesus, who is called Christ? They all said, Let him be crucified. And he said, Why? What evil has he done? But they shouted all the more, Let him be crucified. So when Pilate saw that he was gaining nothing, but rather that a riot was beginning, he took water and washed his hands before the crowd, saying, I am innocent of this man's blood. <clears throat> See to it yourselves. And all the people answered, His blood be on us and on our children. Then he released for them Barabbas, and having scourged Jesus, delivered him to be crucified. Then the soldiers of the governor took Jesus into the praetorium, and they gathered the whole battalion before him. And they stripped him and put a scarlet robe upon him. And plating a crown of thorns, they put it on his head and put a reed in his right hand. And kneeling before him, they mocked him, saying, Hail, King of the Jews. And they spat upon him and took the reed and struck him on the head. And when they had mocked him, they stripped him of the robe and put his own clothes on him and led him away to crucify him. As they went out, they came upon a man of Cyrene 
Simon by name. This man they compelled to carry his cross. Glory to your forbearance, O Lord. Glory to you. The Jews demanded that Pilate have you crucified, O Lord. They found no crime in you, nevertheless they released the convict Barabbas. And they condemned you, the righteous one, and so they incurred the guilt for murder. But you, O Lord, give them their due reward, for they meditate big things against you. Ον πάντα φρύσι και τρέμι και πάσα γλώσσα ύμνη, Χριστόν Θεού δύναμιν και Θεού σοφίαν, οι ιερείς εράπησαν και έδωκαν αυτοχολήν, και πάντα παθήν κατέδεξα το, σωσέ η θέλον ημάς εκ των ανομοιών ημών, το ίδιο αίματι ως φιλανθρωπών. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O Theotokos, through a word you ineffably gave birth to the word. Your Creator, implore Him to save our souls. I, O oh Lord, though the robber had defiled his hands with blood, yet you took him as a fellow traveler. We pray you to number us with him, for you are good and you love humanity. Me gran fonin afiken olis tis en dos tavro megalin pistin evre. Mi arobi esothi ke prodos paradisu pilas aniksas isilthen. O aftu tin metania pros dexamenos. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Rejoice, O maiden, through an angel, you receive the joy of the world. Rejoice, for you gave birth to your Creator and Lord. Rejoice, for you were counted worthy to become the mother of Christ our God. Simeron, cremas cremate fixilu, on yen ida sitin yin cremasas. Today is hung upon a tree. He who suspended the earth in the midst of the waters. Simeron cremate epixilu on en ida sitinin cremasas. He wears a crown of thorns, who is the king of the angels. Observe the porphyrian. Perivalete, o perivalon ton uranon en nefeles. He accepts to be slapped, who freed Adam in the Jordan. Ilis prosilothi. On infios tis ecclesias, he is pierced with a lance. Who is the son 
of the Virgin, proskinumen suta pathi Christe. We venerate your passion, O Christ. Proskinumen suta pathi Christe. Show us also your resurrection.
celebrate Passover like Jews do. For our Passover is Christ. He was sacrificed for us. So let us purify ourselves of all defilement and sincerely pray. My soul, Lord, save us in your love for humanity. O Stavrosu Kyrie, Zoike, Nastasis,
Let us pray to the Lord our God that we may be made worthy to hear the Holy Gospel. Oh Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. With them arise, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. The reading of the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Let us be attentive. Glory At that time, the soldier led Jesus away and said to the palace, that is the praetorium, and they called together the whole battle room, and they clothed him in a purple dark cloth and played him in, in Christ. A crown of throne they put in on him, and they began to salute him, Hail, King of the Jews, and they struck his head with the reed, and spat upon him, and they knelt down in homage to him, and then they had mocked him, they stripped him of the purple cloth, and put his own clothes on him. And they led him out to crucify him, and they compelled a passer by Simon of Carion, who was coming in from the country, the father of Alexander and Rufus, to carry his cross. And they brought him to the place called Golgotha, which means the place of his call, and they offered him wine mingled with myrrh, and he did not take it, and they crucified him, and divided his garment among them, casting us for them to decide what each should take, and it was third hour, then they crucify him. And the description of the charge against him read, The King of the Jews. And with him they crucify two robbers, one on his right hand and one on his left. And those who passed by read him, waging their heads and saying, Aha, you who destroyed the temple and built it in three days, save yourself and come down from the cross. So also the chief priest mocked him to one another with scribes, saying, He saved not us, he cannot save himself. Let the Christ, the King of Israel, come down now from the cross, that we may see and believe. Those who were crucified him also revealed him. Peace be to you who proclaims the good news. Glory to your forbearance, O Lord, glory to you. And the Vasilia sum nisitei mon Kyrie, od anelthis and the Vasilia sum, makari ptochi to pnevmati, oti afton esti Vasilia ton uranon, makari penthundes, oti afti paraklithisonde, makari prais, Oti afti kliranomisusi tin yin di axilu adam para di su gegonen apikos di axilu destavru olistis para di sonokisen omen yefsamenos endolini thetise. Tu pisandos o desistavrumenos Theonomologise ton kryptomenon Nistiti keimon sotir 
and the Vasilia Su. Blessed are they who hunger and thirst for righteousness, for they shall be filled. The transgressors of the law from a disciple bought him who made the law. As though a breaker of the law, they stood him before Pilate's judgment seat. They shouted to crucify the one who gave them manna in the wilderness of old. But we are rather imitate the righteous robber crying aloud in faith and say, Remember us as well in your kingdom, Savior. Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. That swarm of murderers of God, that gathering of Jews who defied the law, in a frenzy cried aloud and demanded Pilate to crucify Christ who was innocent. And instead they asked that Barabbas be released, but we rather cry aloud the words of the grateful Robert to the Lord and say, Remember us as well in your kingdom, O Savior. Legend always blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God, O Christ, your life bearing sign is a spring that like a river out of Eden's flows, and it waters your church as though she were a rational paradise, and from there it separates into the four Gospels as if many heads. It irrigates the world and it fills creation with joy and it teaches the Gentiles faithfully adore and worship your kingdom. Ότι αυτοί ου Θεού κληθήσονται, εσταυρώθη διέμε, ή να μη πηγάσει την άφεση, εκεντήθη την πλευρά, ή να κρούνου ζωή σαν αυλήσει μη τη ύλη προσήλωση, ή να εγώ το βάθη των παθημάτων σου, το ύψο του κράτου σου. Πιστούμενος κράζωση, ζωοδότα Χριστέ, δόξα και το σταυρό σωτήρ και το πάθη σου. Blessed are those who are persecuted for righteousness' sake, for theirs is the kingdom of heaven. When you were crucified, O Christ, all creation trembled on seeing it. The foundations of the earth were quaking in fear of your might, O Lord. The sun and the stars above hid their light. The mountains were shuddering, the rocks split, the temple veil was torn in two. And we, and we with the robber who believed, cry out to you and say, Remember us, O Savior. <coughs> Blessed are you when they revile and persecute you and say all kinds of evil against you falsely for my sake. You have set aside the bond which stood against us, shredding it by your cross. When you were numbered with the dead, you disarmed and bound the tyrants ruling there, delivering everyone from the Bonds of death by your resurrection, to which we were illumined, and we cry out to you, O Lord, who love humanity. Remember us as well in your kingdom, O Savior. Doxa Patrigeo, que ayi opnevmati, ton patera que ion, que to pnevma pandes to agion, homofronos y pisti, doxologin axios exometha, monada theotitos, entris y parcus an hipostases in, asin hiton menus aplin, 
αδιέρετων και απρόσιτων δις εκλητρούμεθα της πυρός της κολάσεως. Rejoice and be glad for your reward is great in heaven. You were lifted on the cross and destroyed the power of death on us. And you set aside the bond which stood against us. And as God you canceled it, grant that we may also have the robbers repentance only friend of man. We faithfully worship you, O Christ our God, and we cry out loud to you. Remember us also when you come in your kingdom. Can in ge a in ge is to se on as to ne on on amin. Tin mitera su Christe, tin en sarkias boros de kusanse. Και παρθένων αληθό και μετά το κον μήνα σου αυθόρων. Αυτή η συμπροσάγωμεν ει πρεσβεία δεσποντά πολύ ελεύθερη. Πτεσμάτων συγχώρηση δωρήσαστε πάντοτε. Τη ισκραυγάζουση μνηστητή και ημών σωτήρ. Έτσι βασιλεία σου. In my garments among themselves, and for my clothing they cast lots. The emeris ato taimati ae aftis ke pitonimatis mon mu evalon gli. God, my God, hear me! Why have you forsaken me? They divided my garments among themselves, and for my clothing they cast. Praise to the Lord our God that we made worthy to hear the Holy Gospel. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Arise, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. Ek tu kato matzeon agio evangelio don agnos ma. Cross for me. Doxasi kirie doxasi. Toke eroi kino erthondes. Η στρατιώτε ή στόπων λεγόμενων ο Γοθάμ, ο έστι λεγόμενο κρεμίου τόπου, έδω και να αυτό πιειν όξου μετα βολή με μειγμένων και γευσάμενο ου κύρθε λεπίν. Σταυρώσαντα δε αυτόν διεμερίζαν το τα ημάτια αυτού βαλώντε πληρών. Ή να πληρωθεί το ρηθέν υπό το προφήτου. Διεμερίσαν το ότι αιμάτια μου εαυτής και υπό το ειτισμα ειτασμόν μου έβαλον κληρών. Και καθήμενοι εστί ετήρων αυτών εκεί και πέθηκαν επάνουν τη κεφαλής αυτού την αιτίαν αυτού γεγραμμένη. Ούτως εστίν ο Ιησούς ο βασιλέας των Ιουδαίων, τότε σταυρώτε συν αυτόν δύο λίστεν εις εκ δεξιών και εις εξ ευωνίμων. Ήδε παραπορευόμενοι ευλαστήμουν αυτόν κι ηνούντες και τις κεφαλάς αυτών και λέγοντες ο καταλίων του ναών και εν τρεις είναι ημέρες οικοδομών σώσε σε αυτόν η Υιός ή του Θεού κατάβηθη από του Σταυρού ομοίως δε και οι αχιερείς επέζοντες μετά των γραμματέων και πρεσβυτέρων και φαρισαίων έλεγον άλλος έσωσε ναι αυτόν ου δύνατε σώσε 
οι βασιλεί, οι βασιλεύς Ισραήλ εστι κατα, καταβάτον νυν από του σταυρού και πιστεύσομεν επ' αυτόν πέπιθεν επί το Θεόν ρισάς τον νυν αυτόν και θέλει αυτόν ή επί υπεργάν ότι Θεού ημί ο Υιός το δε αυτόν ήλιστε εις εις αυτόν αυτόν ονειδίξον αυτόν αποδέκτης εκ της ώρας σκοτώσε γένατο επί πάση την γην έως ώρας ενάτης περί δε την ενάτη ώραν ανεβόησε ο Ιησούς φωνή μεγάλη λέγον ηλί ηλί λιμάσα βάκθανη τούτ εστί Θεέ μου Θεέ μου ή να τι με εκατέλειπες φύνα δε τίνες δε τον εκεί εστώ τον ακούσαντες έλεγον ότι ελίαν φωνή ούτος και ευθέως δραμών εις εξ αυτών και λαβών σπόγγου πλήσας πλήσας τε όξους και περιθείς καλά μου επότισεν αυτόν ή δε λυπη έλεγον άφες είδομεν ή έρχεται ηλία σώσον αυτόν ή δε Ιησούς πάλιν κράξας φωνή μεγάλη αφήκε το πνεύμα και ειδού το καταπέτασμα του ναού εσκίστη εις δύο του από άνωθεν έως κατώ και η γη εισίστη επέτρα εισκίστησαν και τα πνημεία ανεχώθησαν και πολλά σώματα τα κεκειμένων Αγίων γύρθη και εξερθώνται εκ των μνημείων μετά την έργε συναυτού εισήρθον εις τα Αγία Πολύν και ανεφενίστησαν πόλεις και δε εκατόταγκος και, και οι μετά αυτών τηρι, τηρούνται στον Ιησού ειδώνται στον σεισμό και τα γενόμενα ευωθήθησαν ευωθή σφόδρα λέγοντες αληθώς Θεού ο Υιός ειν ούτω Δόξα τη μακροθυμία σου Κύριε δόξα σύ Λέει σον με ο Θεός Κατά το μέγα ελαιόν σου Και κατά το πλήθος των νυκτυρμό σου Εξάλειψον το ανώμημά μου Επιπλήον πλήνον με από της ανομίας μου και από της αμαρτίας μου καθάρισόν με, ότι την ανομία μου εγώ γινώσκω και η αμαρτία μου ενώπιόν μου εστίδει απαντός. Σήμωνο ο ήμαρτον και το πονηρόν ενώπιόν σου επίησα, όπως αν δικαιωθείς εν της λόγης σου και νικήσεις εν το κρίνες θέσε. Η δούγαρ εν ανομίες συνελήφθην και εν αμαρτίες εκείσισέ με η μύτη μου. Η δούγαρ αλήθιεν η γάπη σας, τα άδειλα και τα κρύφια τη σοφία σου εδηλωσάσμη. Ραντιίσμη ισόπο και καθαριστήσομε, πλυνίσμη και υπερχείον αλευκανθήσομε, ακουτιίσμη αγαλία συν και εφροσύνη, αγαλιάσονται ω θέα τέτα πεινωμένα. Απόστρεψον το πρόσωπόν σου από τον αμαρτιόν μου και πάσα στα σανομία μου εξάλειψον. Καρδίαν καθαράν κτίσον εν εμείο Θεό και πνεύμα ευθέ εγγέννησον εν τη εγκάτισμη. Μη απορρίψεις με από του προσώπου σου και το πνεύμα σου το Άγιον μη ανταντέλεις απ' εμού. Απόδος με την αγαλία του σωτηρίου σου και πνεύμα τη ηγεμονικό στήριξόν με. Διδάξω ανώμους τα σωδού σου και ασεβείς επί σε επιστρέψου σου. Ρίσε με εξεμάτων ο Θεός, ο Θεός της σωτηρίας μου, αγαλιάσετε η γλώσσα μου την δικαιοσύνη σου. Κύριε τα χείλη μου ανοίξεις, και το στόμα μου αναγγελεί την ένεσή σου ότι η θέλη σα θυσίαν έδωκα αν ολοκαυτώματα ουκ ευδοκίσεις, θυσία το Θεό πνεύμα συντετριμένων, 
καρδίαν συντετριμένη και τεταπεινωμένη ο Θεό σου και έδωξε δεν όσοι. Αγάθινον κύριε εν τη ευδοκία σου την Σιών και οικοδομηθεί το τα τείχη Ιερουσαλήμ. Τότε ευδοκίσει θυσίαν δικαιοσύνη αναφοράν και ολοκαυτώματα τότε ανίσουσιν επί το θυσιαστήριόν σου μόσχου. That we may be accounted worthy to hearken unto the Holy Gospel, let us supplicate the Lord our God. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Arise, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. The reading of the Holy Gospel according to St. Luke. Let us be attentive. Glory to you, O Lord, glory to you. At that time, two other also were criminals, were led away to be put to death with him. And when they came to the place which is called the Skull, there they crucified him and the criminals, one on the right and one on the left. And Jesus said, Father, forgive them, for they know not what they do and they cast lots to divide his garment and the people stood by watching but the rulers scoffed at him saying he saved others let him save himself if he is the christ of god his chosen one the soldier also mocked him coming up and offering him vinegar and saying, If you are the king of the Jews, save yourself. There was also inscription over him, This is the king of the Jews. One of the criminals who were changed prayed at him, saying, Are you not the Christ? Save yourself and us. But the other rebuked him, saying, Do you not fear God, since you are under the same sentence of condemnation? And we indeed justify justly, for we are receiving the due reward of our deeds. But his man has done nothing. Wrong, and he said to Jew, Jesus, Lord, remember me when you come into your kingdom. And he said to him, Truly I say to you, today you will be with me in paradise. It was now about the sixth hour, and there was darkness over the whole land until the nine hour, while the sun's light fell, and the curtain of the temple was torn in two. Then Jesus crying with a loud voice said, Father, into your hand I commit my spirit. And having said this, he breathed his lungs. Now when the centurion saw that had taken a place, he praised God and said, Certainly this man was innocent. And all the multitudes were assembled to see the sight when they saw what had taken place, return home, beating their breast, and all his acquaintances, and the woman who had followed him from Galilee, stood at a distance and saw the the good news. Glory to your forbearance, O Lord, glory to you. Early in the morning, I rise to you, who empty yourself without changing, 
and submitted to the passion impossibly for the sake of fallen Adam. In your tender mercy, O Lord, O so God, grant me your peace, O Lord, who lost mankind. Doxasi, O Theos, Imon, Doxasi, Rifthendes podas ke prokatharthendes mysterium methexi tu thiun in Christe si pirete exion eleonos mega prosoron sin athlinon imnumen se philanthrope. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. My friends, you said, Lord, see that you are not alarmed. The hour is at hand for me to be taken and killed at the hands of sinners. All of you will be scattered, and you will leave me. But I will gather you, and you will proclaim me to be the one who loves mankind. Early in the morning I rise to you, who empty yourself without changing, and submit it to the passion that's impossibly for the sake of all in Adam. In your tender mercy, O Logos of God, grant me your peace, O Lord, who lost mankind. Έτσι και έτσι εν ειρήνη του Κυρίου Δεϊθόμεν Κύριε Λέησον Αντιλαβούς όσον ελέησον και διαφύλαξον ημάς ο Θεός της συγχαρητής Κύριε Λέησον Τον Αγία Σακράτου υπερευλοημένης εν δόξου δεσπίσης ημών Θεοτόπους και αι προφέρνου Μαρίας με τα πάνω του μνήμου μνημονεύσαντες εαυτούς και αλλήλους και πάσην την ζωή ημών Χριστό το Θεό παραθώ μεθά. Συ Κύριε. Ότι Συ ο βασιλεύς της ειρήνης και σωτήρ των ψυχών ημών και σου την δόξα να πέμπομεν. Του Πατρή και του Υιό και του Αγίου Πνεύμα την ίν και αΐ και εις τους αιώνας των αιωνών. Αμήν. Come let us all extol him who was crucified for us. Mary beheld him on the cross and she said, Though you endure the cross, you are my son and my God. You are my son and my God. Seeing her own lamb being led to the slaughter, Mary the ewe was worn out, and she followed him with the other woman and cried, Where are you going, child? Why are you going so fast? Maybe there is another wedding in Cana, and you are hurrying now to make wine out of water for them. Shall I come with you, child, and stay with you? Say something to me, O word who preserved my chastity. Please do not pass by me in silence. You are my son and my God. You are my son and my God. On April the 22nd, we commemorate our devout father, Theodore Sciotis, Bishop of Anastasiopolis. On this day, the holy martyr Nearchos died by fire. On this day, we also commemorate the holy apostle Nathaniel, who is also Simon the Zealot. This is the commemoration of when he met Christ. On this day, Holy and Great Friday, we celebrate the awesome, holy and saving passion of our Lord and God and Savior Jesus Christ. The spitting, the blows, the buffeting, the mockery, the reveling, the purple robe, the reed, the sponge, the vinegar, the nails, the spear, and above all, the cross and death which he condescended to endure willingly for our sakes. Also the saving confession on the cross of the grateful robber who was crucified with him. Even dead on the cross, you as God are living, O naked corpse and living God's logos. The robber opened the locked gates of Eden using the key of his remember me confession. By your enormous and all infinite <laughs> compassion for us, O Christ our God, have mercy on us. Amen. Then the godly servants ridicule the monument of the ungodly wickedness. But the unlawful counsel righteous now and meditates on vain things 
against the Lord's anointing. Have laws to put to death the one who holds life in his hand. All creation blesses him and glorifies him unto the ages. Doxa si o Theos imon, doxa si, apo blefaron mathite, nin ipnon efis Christe din axate, en prosevhi de Grigorite, piras momi posoliste, ke malista simon, το κρατεό γαρμίζω πειράς, γνώθη με πέτρε, ον πάσα κτήσεις ευλογή δόξα ζουσα εις τους αιώνας. Glory to you, our God, glory to you. Never, said Peter, will I let any profane word slip from my lips, O Lord. As one grateful, I am ready to die with you even if the others all deny you. It was not flesh and blood, but your Father who revealed you to me. All creation blesses you and glorifies you unto the ages. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. You have not fathomed, not the depth of divine wisdom and knowledge nor comprehended the abyss of my judgment, O man. The Lord said to Peter, Since you are flesh, do not boast, for you will three day times deny me, whom all creation blesses and glorifies unto the ages. <laughs> Απαγορεύεις ημών πέτρε, ο περπής χιταχός ο σύρητε, και εσύ παιδί εσγύα θάτων προσελθούς απ' το ίσισε, ο Κύριος έφη πικρός δακρύσας, έξις όμως εβιλατών με, ον πάσα κτήσεις ευλογή, δοξάζουσα εις τους αιώνας. We praise and we bless and we worship the Lord. The godly servants ridicule the moments of ungodly wickedness. But the unlawful counsel rages now and meditates on vain things against the Lord's anointed and plots to put to death the one who holds life in his hand. All creation blesses him and glorifies him unto the ages. Greater in honor than the cherubim, and in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim. You with a corruption gave birth to guard the work, and I truly felt all cause you do we magnify. In the meotera don cherubim, can doxotera, as in gritos don seraphim. Την αδιαφθόρος θεολόγων τεκούσαν, την όντας θεότογων σε μεγαλύνουμε. Glory to you, our God, glory to you, the violent band of soldiers who hated God with the assembly of evildoers. Murderers of God came upon you, Christ, and dragged you off as a culprit. The maker of all things you do we magnify. Glory to you, our God, glory to you, the impious ignorant of the law, who cited the sayings of the prophets to no avail, led you as a lamb to be slaughtered and unjustly. The master over all things you do we magnify. Doxa patri geio ge agio pneumati, tis ethnes in ekdaton tin zoin, sin tis gramatevsi aneris dei eris, 
παρέσχον πληγέντες, αυτοφθόνο κακία των φυσιζόδοτην, ον μεγαλύνουμεν. Both now and forever and to the ages of ages, amen. O King, they surrounded you like many dogs. They struck you and slapped you in the face. And they questioned you, furthermore, they bore false witness against you. You patiently endured it, and thus you saved us all. Greater in honor than the cherubim, and in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim. You without corruption gave birth to God the word. And I truly thought, oh, cause you do we magnify. Eti ke eti nirini to kriyo de itome. Kiri eleison. Eti lavusos on eleison ki tiflaxon imas. O Teos, Ti Sichariti, Kiri Eleison, Ragia Zafrato, Pragimensis, Dafnissimo, Teos Logo, Kiarperte, O Maria, Zemak Tantos, Ton Agio Menos Antes, E Aftos, Ki Alinos, Ki Pas, Antis, O Yinimon, Christo, To Teo, Parato, Si Kyrie, O Dissenus, si pasi dinamis ton uranon, ke si tin doxan la pembusi, tu patri ke tu iho, ke tu iho pnevma tin in ke ai, ke istus eonas ton eonon. Amin, ana esen de alor, the word of the cross illumine me and save me on listening of the meron to paradisu ixiosas kame toxilo tu stavru On the same day, O Lord, you granted the robber paradise. Now by the wood of the cross, illumine me and save me. Let us pray to the Lord our God that we may be made worthy to hear the Holy Gospel. Oh, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Most the Amorites, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. The reading is from the Holy Gospel according to John. It does attend. Glory to you, O Lord, glory to you. At that time, standing by the cross of Jesus were his mother and his mother's sister, Mary the wife of Clopas and Mary Magdalene. When Jesus saw his mother and the disciple whom he loved standing near, he said to his mother, Woman, behold your son. Then he said to the disciple, Behold your mother. And from that hour the disciple took her to his own home. After this, Jesus, knowing that all was now finished, said to fulfill the scripture, I thirst. A bowl of vinegar stood there, so they put a sponge full of the vinegar on hyssop and held it to his mouth. When Jesus received the vinegar, he said, It is finished. And he bowed his head and gave up his spirit. Since it was the day of preparation in order to prevent the bodies from remaining on the cross on the Sabbath, for that Sabbath was a high day, the Jews asked Pilate that their legs might be broken and that they might be taken away. So the soldiers came and broke the legs of the first and of the other who had been crucified with him. 
But when they came to Jesus and saw that he was already dead, they did not break his legs. But one of the soldiers pierced his side with a spear, and at once there came out blood and water. He who saw it has borne witness, and his testimony is true, and he knows that he tells the truth, that you also may believe. For these things took place that the scripture might be fulfilled. Not a bone of him shall be broken. And again another scripture says, They shall look on him whom they have pierced. Glory to you. Φρέα συντετριμένων 
के फोर सो कनी कन See, Lord, have mercy. Arise at us, hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. The reading of the Holy Gospel according mm. to St. Mark. Let us be attentive. Glory to you, O Lord. Glory to you. At that time, Joseph D'Armatea, a respected <coughs> member of the council, who was also himself looking for the kingdom of God, <coughs> took a courage and went to Pilate and asked for the body of Jesus. And Pilate wondered if he were already dead, and summoning in the centurion, he asked him whatever, whether he was already dead. And when he learned from the centurion, that he was there, he granted the body to Joseph, and he bought a linen shroud, and taking him down, wrapped him in a linen shroud, and led him in a tomb which had been you out of the rock, and he rolled a stone against the door of the tomb. Mary Magdalene and Mary, mother of Mo Joseph, saw where he was <laughs> Glory to your forbearance, O Lord, glory to you. Si doxa prepi, Kyrio Theosimon, ke si tin doxa na pempume, to patri ke to io, ke to io pnevmati, nin ke ai ke Jesus eona sona eonon, amin. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill to men. We praise you, we bless you, we worship you, we glorify you, and we thank you for your great glory. Lord King, Heavenly God, Father Almighty, Only Begotten Son, Lord Jesus Christ and Holy Spirit, Lord God, the Lamb of God, the Son of the Father, who took away the sin of the world, have mercy on us, you who took away the sins of the world. Accept our supplication, you who sit at the right hand of the Father, and have mercy on us. For you are the only Holy One, you are the only Lord Jesus Christ. To the glory of God the Father, Amen. 
Every day I shall bless you, and I shall praise your name forever, and unto the ages of ages. Lord, you have become as a refuge from generation to generation. I have said, Lord, have mercy on me, heal my soul, for I have sinned against you. Lord, to you I have fled, teach me to do your will, for you are my God. For with you is the fountain of life, in your light we shall see light. Extend your mercy to those who know you. Grant, O Lord, that in this day we may be kept without sin. Blessed are you, O Lord, the God of our fathers, and praised and glorified is your name unto the ages. Amen. Let your mercy, Lord, come upon us, just as we have hoped in you. Blessed are you, O Lord, teach me your commandments. Blessed are you, O Master, make me understand your commandments. Blessed are you, O Holy One, enlighten me with your commandments. Lord, your mercy remains forever. Do not turn away from the works of your hands. To you belongs praise. To you belongs a hymn. To you belongs glory. To the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Now and ever and to the ages of ages. Amen. Let us complete our morning prayer to the Lord. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and protect us, O God, by your grace. Lord, have mercy. For a perfect, holy, peaceful, and sinless day, let us us of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. And as you repeat the faithful God, God, in our souls and bodies, let us us of the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. For forgiveness and remission of our sins and transgressions, let us us the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. For all that is good and beneficial for our souls and for peace in the world, let us serve the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. For the completion of our lives in peace and repentance, let us serve the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. For Christian and our life, peaceful without shame and suffering, and for a good account of ourselves before the awesome and judgment seat of Christ, let us ask the Lord. Grant this, O Lord. Remember our most holy, most pure, blessed, and, and glorious in your daughters, and our Virgin Mary with all the saints. Let us commend ourselves and one another and our whole life to Christ, our God. To you, O Lord. For you are the God of mercy and compassion and love for mankind. And to you we give glory, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Peace be with you all. And with your spirit. Let us bow our heads and to the Lord. To you, O Lord. O Holy Lord, you dwell in high and regard the humble of heart, and with your all-seeing eye behold all creation. To you we bow the neck of our soul and body, and we entreat you, O Holy of Holies, extend your invisible hand from your holy dwelling place and bless us all. And if in anything we have sinned voluntary or involuntary, forgive us, since you are a good God who loves humanity, granting us your earthly and heavenly blessings. For yours it is to show mercy and to save us, O our God, and to you we give glory, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Let us pray to the Lord our God that we may be made worthy to hear the Holy Gospel. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Wisdom arise, let us hear the Holy Gospel. Peace be unto all. And with your spirit. Amen. <laughs> Que Nicodemos o el thon proston isun, nictosto proton, feron nigmas mirnis, que alois os litras ecato ecaton, elevan unto soma tu isu, 
και έδισεν αυτόν και οδονείς μέτα των αρωμάτων καθώς έθος εστί των της Ιωδαίους εν τα φιάζειν ειν δε εν το τόπο ουπον σταυρώθη κήπος και εν το κήπο μνημείων κενών ενώ ουδέποτε ουδείς ετέθη εκεί ουδιά το παρισκευήν το Ιουδαίον ότι εγγύσει το μνημείον έθηκε τον Ιησού Δόξα τη μακρόθυμία σου Κύριε δόξα σύ Suspended on the cross today, O Word of God, she lamented with motherly emotions, and it cruelly broke her heart. She sighed with pain from the depths of her soul, tearing at her face and her hair, and it wore her out. Then beating her breasts, she mournfully cried aloud, Woe is me, my divine child! Alas, the light of the world! Why did you sing from before my eyes, O Lamb of God? Then the host of bodiless angels were overcome by trembling, and they said, Incomprehensible Lord, glory to you! 
Ο δε Θεός βασιλεύσιμων προαιώνων ήργασε τον σωτηρίαν εν μέσω της γης επί Yeah. 
so they went and they made the sepulchre secure oh, by sealing the stone and setting a god Άγιος ο Θεός, Άγιος ισχυρός, Άγιος αθάνατος ελέησον ημάς, Άγιος ο Θεός, Άγιος ισχυρός, Άγιος αθάνατος ελέησον ημάς, Άγιος ο Θεός, Άγιος ισχυρός, Άγιος αθάνατος ελέησον ημάς, Δόξα Πατρί και Υιό και Αγίο Πνεύματι, και νυν και αή και ει του αιώνα των αιώνων αμήν. Παναγία τριά, ελέισον ημά, κύριε, η λάστιτη τα σαμαρτία σημών, δέσποτα συγχώρησον τα σανομία σημών, άγιε επίσκεψε και ίεσε τα ασθενεία σημών, ένεκεν το όνοματό σου. Κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον, κύριε Λέισον, δόξα πατρί και ιό και αγίο πνεύματι, και νυν και αή και ει του αιώνα των αιώνων αμήν. Πάτερ ημών. Ο Ιησού Ανής, αιστεί το όνομά Σου, ελθάτε βασιλεία Σου, γεννηθεί το ταταλήμά Σου, ως ενυρανό και επί της γης, τον άρτον ημών τριβιούσιον, δώσ' ημιν σήμερον, και άφησ' ημιν τα θρήματα ημών, ως και ημις τα θρήματα της ευρωσμών, και εμείς και να εισημάς της ευρωσμών, αγαρίς ημάς από το πόνο ότι σου έστεινε η βασιλεία και η δύναμη και η δόξα, η πατρό και του ιού και του αγίου πνεύματο, νυν και αή και ει του αιώνα των αιωνών. Αμήν. You ransom those from thy curse of thy love by your precious blood. And you were pierced with a spear, and you gushed forth immortality. For humanity, our Savior, glory to you. Exigoras esimas, ectis cataras tu nomu, todi mi. Σου αίματι το σταυρό προσιλωθεί και τη λόγχη κεντρηθεί. Την αθανασία ανεπίγα σαν θρόπη. Σωτηρήμον δόξα σύ. You ransom us from the curse of the law by your precious blood. You were nailed to thy cross and you were pierced with a spear and you gushed forth immortality. For humanity, our Savior, glory to you. Oh. Have mercy on us, O God, according to great mercy. We pray to you, hear us, and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Let us pray for pious and orthodox Christians. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Let us pray for our Archbishop and Father Sava. Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison. Let us pray for our brethren and priests, higher monks, deacons, and monastics, and Our brotherhood in Christ. Kiri eleison, Kiri eleison, Kiri eleison. Let us again pray for mercy, life, peace, health, salvation, protection, and forgiveness of the sins of all pious, all God's Christians living and visiting in this city. The parishioner, the member of the parish council, <laughs> and every minister of this parish, and all donors and benefactors. Of this holy church, Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison. Let us again pray for the blessed, ever more founder of this holy church, 
and for all our fathers, mo mothers, brothers, and sisters who are asleep <coughs> here in the land of uh, all Orthodox everywhere. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Let us again pray for those who do charitable work, for those who serve in this holy house, for those who labor, teach and sing, and for all the people here present who await your great rich mercy. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. For you are a merciful God who loves mankind, and to you we give glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Wisdom, Father, bless. Blessed are you, Christ our God, always, now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. The Lord God make firm the holy and pure faith of the pious Orthodox Christians, together with the holy great Church of Christ, our holy archdiocese, this holy metropolis and this city to the ages of ages. Amen. Greater in honor than the cherubim, and in glory greater beyond compare than the seraphim, you without corruption gave birth to God the Word, in our truly Theotokos, you do we magnify. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Father, bless. May he who endured the spittings, the scourgings, buffetings, and the cross and death for our salvation, Christ our true God, through the intercessions of his most pure and holy mother, the power of the precious and life-giving cross, the protection of the honorable body of those powers of heaven, the supplication of the honorable glorious prophet and forerunner John the Baptist, the holy glorious and praiseworthy apostles, the holy glorious and triumphant martyrs of our righteous and God-bearing fathers, of the holy righteous ancestors of God, and Joachim and Anna, and of all the saints, may he have mercy on us and save us, for he is a good and merciful God who loves mankind. May the Holy Trinity bless, protect, and keep all of you. Please be seated just for a moment. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. There's not enough time to say everything that needs to be said on a night like tonight. This has been I will just say personally, one of the more enjoyable Thursday night services that I have had since I've been a priest. And not because I did everything correctly, if you were following along, you know that I didn't. I can't explain it beyond just saying that this peace in this moment is very, very thick this evening. The Lord said whenever he was speaking about his death, 
the Lord said to the people that I, he was speaking about himself, I, when I am lifted up, I will draw all people to myself. We know historically that the act of crucifixion is a very gruesome, a very painful, among the most humiliating forms of death that has ever been devised on this earth. I will not describe it to you. You can go and look it up if you would like. But it really is, truly, a a form of torture and death that was meant to draw shame to the crime so that other people would not follow suit and be guilty of these kinds of crimes. So many people, when they would see a person crucified, would have to kind of hold themselves back from being grossed out or whatever at, that, at the site. And when I see depictions even in movies of Christ crucified, I also have that same kind of gut feeling of, you know, reeling back. But when I see the way our Lord is depicted here, in an almost all icons that we have within the Orthodox Church, I continue to look at Jesus Christ not only as King, not only as Lord, not only as Savior and so many names we can give him, but this night is the night that I focus so much on him as a prophet. Because we should not be drawn to Christ on a cross. The very sight of a person crucified should make us run the other direction. And yet year after year, when we see our Lord crucified on this evening, we can't wait. (laughs) We can't wait to come and venerate him to bow in front of the icon of the Lord. It's almost as if it's a magnet calling us. And why shouldn't it? Why should not we be attracted to the Lord at all times of our lives? especially tonight. His words are not words if he is prophet only for the times that he was alive. His words speak today and are continuing to be fulfilled as we try to live the life that he has asked us to live. But it first begins by making sense of this.
And I'm not trying to tell you that I have made sense of it. I mean, I can answer all the questions if you ask me why Jesus died. It still, in some ways, doesn't make sense. And that's when I realize, that's when we should realize that the love that God truly has for us it's beyond measure and yet it's still a love that we are being asked to have in our lives for him and for each other So take as many moments as you need. I purposely waited to speak until the service was over. I do not have any plan beyond eventually doing a few of the services of the hours throughout the night and we'll finish them in the morning at nine o'clock. We'll finish whatever's left, we'll finish in the morning. Take as much time with Christ on the cross as you need.